hello everyone so in this particular video we are going to see how actually we can use the select function in a PySpark so let me give you first example with that example let's try to under the select function where actually we can use that so suppose you have a one of the data frame in this data frame you have a 50 plus column but I am interested only in a five columns five columns so if uh, if i only want to see five column from the 50 plus column so what actually i can use i can use a select function so select function we use to select a single column select function we use to select a multiple column select function we use to select a column by index these are the possibility we have uh, with the help of the select function so in this video we are going to see how to select a specific column from a data frame how to select a multiple column from a data frame and how to use a select function so let me open my Databricks. I created a new notebook lab 3 and uh, my compute is also ready. The cluster is also ready. What I will do, I'll just try to upload one file and that file actually uh, we'll see how actually we can read that. We can create a data frame and how actually we can use a select function. So I'll just upload the employee1.csc file. This is the file which I am uploading. If you have already uploaded that that you can use it again so this is the file location I have now what will be the first thing first thing is to create a data frame how actually we can create a data frame this is a CSV file spark dot read dot CSV and uh, you can pass this particular location and after that we had to make header equal to the true and infer schema true so that the schema also it got selected automatically infer, infer schema true let me try to execute you can see my data frame got created if i want to see the data frame what actually i can use i can use a df dot so if i'll that i'll be able to see uh, my data frame now Suppose my requirement is like I don't I am not interested into this uh, location and email column. I am only interested in employee ID name, employee ID and the salary column. So how actually I can uh, select only the specific column and I can see that. So for that we have a select statement. So how actually we can use a uh, select functions? Let's see that. So for that we have to use a df dot select. After that open a bracket on which particular column you are interested i am interested in the employee id column and also i am interested in a salary column so i will mention both and after that what we have to do if you want to view so for that we have to use a so so what i am writing df dot select employee id and the salary column dot so if i'll write and if i will execute you can see I am only able to view the employee ID and the salary column. The another way of writing is like df dot select. You can write like this also df dot employee ID or df dot salary. And if you will write dot so, let me execute. This will also work. So there are two ways to write this either you can write like this df dot select and the in a bracket in a curly in a inverted comma you can pass the employee id and the whatever the column you required and after that you have to so, so or you can use like this df dot select and df dot employee id df dot salary dot so if you'll do then also you will be able to view now let's see how actually we can uh, read the data frame using a column index so for taking example suppose this is my data frame right in this data frame i have employee id name salary address location and email so the first column the index will be the zero the name index will be the one salary index will be the two address index will be the three location index will be four email index will be the five now my requirement is like i want to view the data from a name to the locations how actually i can do so this is the first index right so what actually i can write from the 1 to 1 2 3 4 5 so 1 to 5 if i will view i will be able to see name salary address and the location so let's see well, 
how actually we can write so if I write df dot select df dot column columns if I write one two five dot so you can see uh, from a name to the location I am able to see let me show you the data frame first what I am doing so what I have written I have written from the one first index to the fifth index so you can see employee ID is a zero index for what is the first index it is a name so the name column is showing what is the second index two it is showing three index showing four index is showing when you are mentioning five means till four it will show if you will uh, write six then till fifth index it will show what is the fifth index email so that you can see the email also is coming if i'll write three then till two index it will show you can see name and the salary what is the first index first index is the employee ID. second index is the name uh, first index is the name and the second index is the salary so like that with the help of the column index also we can select the column so i hope you got the idea how actually we can use the select uh, function in a pie spark.